Thank you so much. It is 916 on the dot now and here's what's new this hour. School is almost out and with it comes summer of entertaining the kiddos. But don't worry, Margaret Ann is joined with Bethany Winston from Kidding Around Greenville to show you all things fun and free you can do right here in the upstate all summer long. Yeah, the countdown is on and thanks to Bethany here, all of you mom and dads can avoid some of that stress when it comes to keeping your kids entertained without breaking the bank. So of course, first we want to start with these free and budget friendly activities yes. that parents can do with their kids right here in the upstate. Yes, yeah, so there's a bunch of different things available. You know, one of the first things I think about is there's the Kids Bowl Free program. So you can actually sign up on kidsbowlfree.com and your kids can bowl free for the whole summer. You have to pay for the shoe rental, but that's it. Wow, that's awesome. Something yes. I didn't even know about, <laughs> probably because I don't have kids. But it is inside, which is nice too in the summer around here. <laughs> oh, absolutely. It gets really hot. And you have kids yourself, of course. And so what are some of your um, kids' favorite activities or summer activities? Yes, yeah, so we love going to parks, hiking, going to the library, you know, a lot of the things that a lot of people like around here yeah. to do during the summer, but awesome. there's so many awesome things to do. Yeah, and um, how do you guys kind of keep it mixed up so uh, folks don't get bored at home with the same things over and over again? So, I mean, obviously you can go to kiddingaroundgreenville.com and there's like so many ideas. Like I even go there myself sometimes when I get bored. <laughs> yeah. But, you know, I think like with like some of the programs, like Park Hop is another example. You know, you can okay. sign up for Park Hop over the summer and then go to different parks all summer to earn prizes. So just mm -hmm. doing things like that where you kind of maybe go a little bit outside the box. You do something that's, a, you know, not the same park you always go to. Just go to a different park. It's an easy way to, you know, just take things and spice it up a little bit with, yeah. you know, with still keeping it free and simple. Absolutely. And with school being out, how can parents out there promote learning while still having fun? That's a big one, like the summer reading programs, that sort of thing. Yes, yeah, so the summer reading program is definitely a great way to do that. Um, a lot of people don't realize this, but there's a lot of activities going on at the library mm -hmm. too. So it's oh. not just reading the books, which is great, but you can also go and have fun, you know, watch the Critter Keeper, or they have people coming in doing like singing activities and things. So there's that, and then you sign up and earn prizes for reading during the summer, which is great. That is awesome. All right. And then what are some special events that parents can throw on the calendar for their kids to look forward to maybe later on in the summer? Yeah, so I know one of the things that we always like to tell people about is the free outdoor movies in the area. Oh, yeah. So some of the schedules are still coming out, but Greer's already posted their schedule. And on select Thursday nights in Greer, you can go see a movie for free out of their amphitheater. And they even have activities going on beforehand. So it's a full family night, and it's completely free. Awesome. And then, of course, all of that is on kiddingaroundgreenville.com, yes, right? Yes, we have a full summer list, so you can find all this stuff plus a lot more. Okay, all right, Bethany, thank you so much. And of course, we'll have that and a lot more with Bethany on foxcarolina.com, Ashley.